you start. Okay, so <laughs> about 10 days ago, Rosie's cat Flynn jumped off the kitchen side onto some moisture and really hurt his leg. So we took him to the vets and he unfortunately had kind of a broken Dis leg. Yeah, it's like, it's, it's, it's a broken leg, he's, he's broken, instead of breaking his leg in two, you know, um, you know, that's quite easily solved with a cast because you put it back together, his whole hip joint, the head of his hip, had come off from his leg, literally come apart. So, and you can't bandage together a hip and cast it. It was just floating around in him, making him really, really ill. And, you know, obviously him walking was, like, ridiculously painful. Yeah, but the thing is, it was kind of weird because he wasn't actually screaming or he no. was just... He was still into his food. He's such a good baby that he, he didn't whine that much, so we didn't know how serious he was, but Rose was like, we've got to take him to the vet. So we took him to the vet. And they were like, he needs a major operation. Yeah. I and I was like, a leg transplant? And they're like, no, we don't do that. And I was like, that's ridiculous. So they said, instead of a leg transplant, we will just fix his knee. And I said, conventional. Um, if you want to get technical, okay, you're not the vet. Okay. <laughs> you are not the vet. <laughs> and they said, it's going to be a thousand pounds. That has three zeros after the one. Yeah, and um, I was like, can I pay in direct debit? Because I'm a student and I have zero money anyway. Plus my, like, and minus, they were like, plus my minus 2,755. <laughs> and they were like, forget about the money, show us your nipple. We had absolutely no way of paying that kind of money because Rosie's a student, I, I am on a very poor salary. <laughs> and someone messaged me, I think it was actually a lady called Julie, was definitely one of the first people to message me, but it was more than one person actually, messaged me on Twitter and said, where do I write the cheque to? If you get the button, I will donate. And, you know, other people will be happy to. In the first few seconds, I mean, Rosie was like, God, someone's just donated five pounds. I was like, God, that's amazing. And then she was like, someone's just donated 50 pounds. I was mm. like, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. And then she was like, someone's just donated one million. No, I thought that not many people would donate because I, I thought people aren't going to understand how much this is affecting me. I thought people aren't going to realise I'm getting really emotional. <laughs> I thought people aren't going to realise how much I love Flynn and how, how much he means to me. Sorry. Get your shit together! <laughs> that was me. I love you. I thought no one would realise <laughs> just how, how much... I just didn't think people cared about their cats as much as I cared about my cats, but I was wrong. I just love How cats. wrong was I? I was fucking wrong. You want to hug all the cats. I just love cats. I love cats again. <laughs> and Rosie's gonna sleep with all of you. So mm. Oh I will. It's win -win. If Rose lets me. I'm I will. filming it. <laughs> anyway, so it was for the cat's benefit and um luckily Sorry, just <laughs> Rosie, this is a very serious video. Everyone was posting pictures of their cats. I got um, I uh, all their cats and everyone was saying I love you. Wait, blow! No, I don't need to blow. Sorry. That's what she said. And we got um, about 400, 500 by two in the morning. Amazing. Mm. I could have started maybe more, like maybe more. a pimps and hose business with that. Mm. The cat comes first. Um, so it was for now. He's so grateful. He asked me to give you this message that he wrote. Dear everyone, um, my name is Flynn Sporton. And I am a ginger cat who hurt his leg very badly. Thank you to all the people that donated. I still hate everybody, but my leg is doing well. Thanks again, Lefin. I just, I really mean it. I want to say thank you so much. We love you. Flynn loves you. We will film Flynn more. He and will this, say thank you. This is Flynn at the vet's being an angel. Can you purring? People have donated for you. You've now got a college fund. <laughs> oh, Oh, oh God! It's all right, oh, Harry. It's really shocked me. I know, but it's in fashion. Flynn, you've got to keep it on. Flynn, oh. we could probably get better phone reception standing by him. He's crying. No, no, he's not. It's okay. <laughs> Baby, do another one. Oh, honey, do you know what this one? Go on, have a little bit. Good boy. Oh, you're being so good. You're being so good. We're just gonna give him his medicine. So Rosie, that just literally goes in the end of there, okay? It's like a little vacuum. Okay. And then you just set this out to a 5.5. Okay. Okay. Yeah, and then what do you do? And then I think we just remove it. 
Yeah, we do. Yeah. So, Flynn, you're not going to like this. Oh, but no. remember that I love you. We're filming this. It's going to go horribly wrong. Um, come on, baby. You ready, big sis? I just thought you were going to squirt it in, all right? Oh, what's that? What's that, baby? Is he drinking it? Come on. Come on, baby. This is going to be slightly harder than that. Come on, in again, in again. Hold on, in again. <laughs> so good with him, Rose. The worst part was when she shoved the thermometer up his ass. You're such a good boy. <laughs> you look like Meryl Streep in The Devil Wears Prada. If he looks up when it rains, he's indoors, it's fine. Okay. <laughs>